All right. The title of our message today is, is simply this. Pleasing and acceptable to God. Can we all say that? Pleasing and acceptable to God. Let me try this here. Pleasing. Let's say it again. Pleasing and acceptable to God. Let's personalize it. I want you to say, I am pleasing and acceptable to God. Who is pleasing and acceptable to God? The devil at this point, that's where he counteracts the truths of the word of God by sowing doubt in your heart. Let's confront him together. I want you to say, I am pleasing and acceptable to God. Say it again. I am pleasing and acceptable to God. In other words, God, when he looks at you and me, he is pleased. Do you believe that? When God looks at us, he is what? He is pleased. So the devil doesn't want us to believe that. He's already piling on accusations, condemnation, and everything else. Today we are confronting him with the truth of the word of God. And the word says to God, I am pleasing God. I am acceptable to God. And that settles it. We are not asking for his approval. The devil. We are telling him to God, I am pleasing. I am acceptable. I want us to establish that. Alright? So, even if you are not saved, my friend, you can walk out of here today pleasing to God and acceptable to God by giving your life to Jesus. Even you who has given their lives to Christ, but you are being naughty in the spirit. By that I mean doing things you know you are not supposed to do. And oh yes, don't even try that game. Ask me what are the things I'm not supposed to do. You know them. Because as you do it, you know this is not right. You can also walk out of here pleasing and acceptable to God by repenting. God wants us to please him. Oh, hallelujah. My bond with God. So through Jesus, we can be pleasing to God. The thing that condemns you, do not ignore it like your death. That will not take the debt away. It will not take the debt away. Knowing that there is something condemning you, ignoring it will not take it away. Is when you take it to Jesus and say, Lord, I'm asking you, forgive me. Then he cleanses you. And then again, you are pleasing and acceptable to God. Does that make sense? So we are pleasing and acceptable to God. All right. Hallelujah. 
through Jesus we can be pleasing to God. <laughs> Romans chapter 3 verses 22 to 24 this is what Paul says. I want us to look at that scripture. What is this righteousness of God? Whose righteousness are we talking about? Is the righteousness of God. It's not our righteousness. Don't try to be right. You can't. God clothes us with his righteousness when we say yes to Jesus. Let me help you again. God clothes us with his righteousness when we say yes to Jesus. Not when we join a church. Not when we become members of a church. It's when we say yes to Jesus. God clothes us with his righteousness. So let us listen to that. Put it, this righteousness of God comes through faith in Jesus Christ. For all those, whether you are a Jew or a Gentile, who believe and trust in him and acknowledge him as God's son. When you do that, God clothes you with his righteousness. Hallelujah. So whenever he looks at you now, he sees his righteousness. He doesn't see yours because yours failed. Mine failed. Jesus had to die to bring that righteousness. I have a soccer team that I support. They are the godly team. When I wear their colors <laughs> and I walk into a mall, not even somewhere else, whoever is godly, in that mall. And they see me. They see themselves. Well, here he's calling me from ah, ah. Yeah. I don't stop and ask. And uh, so who are you? No. It's given. He is led by God. <laughs> Just like me. <laughs> Nothing personal. Why are they paying attention to me in the crowd? It's because when they look at me, they see what they identify with. When God looks around and he sees his righteousness over you, immediately, God says, go amlo, go amlo, go amlo. Because when we say yes to Jesus, we are somebodies. He with his righteousness. Oh, hallelujah. When I see somebody, <laughs> you, you, you can hear as they speak. No, but this one. Mm. No, this one. It's God's righteousness. Are you getting that? So, child of God, make sure. <laughs> You are always in your uniform. The heavenly uniform. That's God's righteousness. What is God's righteousness? Right standing with God. If anything happens to tunish this garment, immediately I run to him and say, it doesn't belong here. I'm sorry, Father. Cleanse me from this. Because every time he looks, he must see this garment. Glory to Jesus. Not yours. 
No, I try to help poor people there. I try to help. No, that's your righteousness. It means nothing here. Isaiah will offend you. Your own righteousness. It's like filthy rags before God. It's because I can say you you tried, you tried. When you busy breaking. I'm trying, Pastor. Yeah, they are old grannies, I assisted yeah, they are old grannies, I cut their nails. And what do you think? What do you think? Yes, what do you think? Because yours and mine will never meet that standard. That's why when Christ died and we said yes to Jesus, yes, God, God, his righteousness. Put his righteousness on us. Right? Mm. Say it again. I am pleasing and I'm acceptable to God. Not because I did it myself. I like what he says. Uti, there is no distinction since all have sinned. How many have sinned? All. By mother's room, there are cute sinners there. Yo, ask the mother. Who taught this tiny thing to bite the mother? Morning. Breastfeeding. Morning, and now you're not going to do my hand. Can't hear school when you teach all that. Never went to school. All have sinned. And he says, and continually fall short of the glory of God. And are being justified. I'll say it again, justified. It, I am justified. It, I'm justified. The amplified, what is to be justified? You are declared free of the guilt of sin. When Satan comes to accuse, I think in 1950, Okay, what you want to what? Unga to send on. Don't make yourself look at that. Who looks at you? Satan says to the devil, free from guilt. You are declared not guilty. Oh, glory to his name. So when you are justified, <laughs> the heavens are saying, you are now standing there just as if you've never seen. Crooks and criminals that used to be in the they may remind you of what they stand with his mind. The heavens declare just as if I've never seen. Because when I repented, David says he took my iniquity away from me as far as the east is from the west never to meet again. David says he threw my sins into a sea of forgiveness and forgetfulness. But if you are Christian. ignorant of this truth, you will own up to that. Because the truth is you were stealing people's bank cards. You were very merciless. 
Ulemaza ne principal. We are yours, Lord. But now in Christ, when I said yes to Jesus and I admitted my sin, I asked him to forgive me. Whoever brings that accusation, it doesn't stick. Because the heavens are saying, declared not guilty. Declared not guilty. Oh, hallelujah. Number two, made acceptable to God. <laughs> Number three, granted eternal life. So every time we put ourselves in our position of adoption, that is, our sonship in Christ. You are not just anybody's. You belong to Jesus. All right. You will ask. Okay, man, I let man do your manifest. So here is a statement I made. The matter that caused us to be separated from God. Landaba, ea isenza, ogokuba sohukaniswe notiko. Ya lungiswa. It was dealt with at the cross. Mandi ipinde. Let me repeat that. Landaba, and you ask where you call. That matter, you know it was there. Remember, if I, no, I can have a dispute with Ruaz. <laughs> yes. And if and if families families now get involved, miraculously somewhere, we reconcile. When we meet, after the reconciliation, I don't say to him, no, thank you, Shweme. That brought me to you. Asked me, I still denied it. I don't have any cars in when we meet now, oh, Tugayo, as one as no goal, looking at Abu's Bahibo, see Tiguye, say to the Landaba, no, that matter, ya lungis, has been resolved. We have one again, Pango Tico, before God, Landaba, that matter, ya lungs, has been resolved at the cross. You are going to go and say, it, it is your own business. Otherwise, it's for us, it's none of our business. Oh, hallelujah. hallelujah. That is justification. So that matter has been resolved. Listen to what he says to the Ephesians, chapter 2, verse 13. The Passion Translation says, It yet look at you now. <laughs> This is what is key. I mean, you can come and ah, talk about the things that God was doing. But if someone says, but look at me now. <laughs> look at me now. One year I was his a and a testimony. This is a testimony. I'm not embarrassing. We meet somebody who he says to me is not saved. He says be with this brother. He says, Pastor, this thing of this Jesus works. This one has turned yo. out like this. So, this is testimony. This is a testimony. 
You know what this person said? Who the pastor? Let chap my cash it down all. My cash it down all. He be so chumbai. Equal the fire stage. He needs to climb on stage. Even if it doesn't open a face, it in him. He must say, "This is me." It was a pagama go when. Who sit in barn? Oh my! Oh full of banche. Who the arm from this hour sit? Long for who banche? Who has become like this? Oh, hallelujah. You know, Ndaba, Kubani Mfundi. Master Songa said, look at me now. Say it again, look at me now. The man tell us Satan of that. As he brings them from the grave. It is Satan. Look at me now. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. That's one thing he cannot look at. Baba, it reminds him of his future in hell. Would he look at me now? Would he everything is new? Everything. I got a pastor. God saved with him. <laughs> Unandoni. <laughs> Goba everything. Go everything. Go on, every yonke, not some yonke, things. Yonke, everything. Yonke, everything. Yonke, everything yonke, in Christ is new. Wow. Where are the phone divide? Yeah, somebody hears me. Would you, although you were once distant and far away from God, now, when, now, when, now, you have been brought delightfully close to Him through the sacred blood of Jesus. You have actually been united to Christ. Glory to Jesus. We were cast off something that nobody wanted. People didn't like you. Nobody was interested in you. Whenever you showed up. But look at me now. I said, look at me now. <laughs> Everything is new. Through Christ. Christ. They say it again, I am pleasing. And I'm acceptable to God. Just come to Jesus. I said, just come to Jesus. Come to Jesus. Don't run away from him. Come to Jesus. Did you want a drug dealer? Come to Jesus. Come to Jesus. Yes. 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 Never seen one like him. Who gives gives even one who doesn't deserve to be forgiven. That is Jesus. Yes, Lord. He gives, gives until people are offended when they but are not not in alone. Not in alone. But not with Jesus. He died for the sinners of the world. Not the righteous. The righteous he died for the sinners of the world. I, I may not like your but style, but Christ is seated. Oh, hallelujah. I born with God. I want this to sink in our spirits. Because we are constantly accused by the accuser of the brethren. And when we are ignorant of the truths of the word of God, we accept the accusations. 
Uzivu, yo, and you feel I'm not happy at all. And I'm not happy at all. I don't know what it is. It is because accusation. they accepted the accusation. <laughs> so, God is now on our side. And we are now on God's side. Let us say it. God is now God is on our side. side. Say it like you mean it. God is now on our side. <laughs> and we are on his side. <laughs> and we are on his side. <laughs> and we are on his side. So sustains a lot of nyike. Who call Indwana eleven cons when the young man that was in the church here? Eh, you are Cobella Lama Pass. Yeah, he used to bring a lot of money for this. Um, so that's our figure late intentional. I would arrive late, Gabo. If you know, I want to see the power you could burn here. Who's got the power here? If I say it's this one, I be. <laughs> <laughs> and I said, I have to leave. Yeah, I don't know. I'm prepared as well. And if you contest, I don't want a contest. A contest. That's if you don't do one week, I want to annihilate anything that is weak in that room. So I have not identified this I get in and I keep quiet. I will stand up with this five rand. With this 20 rand, I leave. I'm, I'm listening to one who's going to say something serious. I will stronger you. I'm stronger you. Okay, no, this one is okay. Rand he says with this hundred rand. With this two hundred, we say. Was better zong as is a five rand. All the five rand guys. They keep quiet. That figure any one and this will be a government. They could be a pant away gate blooms. You weak. I found out a poma when you mean up a wicket. Chased outside. If you form Ulogos and have a wicket. What happened? He says, no, I've been chased out. I said, listen, walk behind me. When we walk inside, I look at the Lord our days. I will work with this 300 rand. I declare this with you. You must be the one in charge of this event. Five rand, best him, Kupile. We chase him out, we chase him. Did you get a hundred rand? With this hundred rand. Did you wear a poem? Wear a poem. Babu's buyers. I have girls in one. I am up. I have girls. I have to be Lily Pajay, Chula Pai, Yatima Melani, Gamato, and Chinchilis in Dongo. Once again, what happened? Well, Allah, you are on the Elina man, powerful side. I'm saying to you now, God is on our side, and we are on His side. I don't know, but nobody talks anyhow to us. You can associate yourself with weak stuff. Come to Jesus. When He is on our side, ha ha. Why did you What is Melani Isn't those chinchilla? But you have a good pile. Did you wear a puma letter run puma, five run puma? Did you go to Kumbu? I guess in one. I guess I don't. He won it. Allah. Lina man is on the right side, the powerful side. We have a right to sit and talk and speak as we because we are on this side, the side of power. God is on our side, and we are on God's side. <laughs> Paul 
Paulus is asking in Romans 8. So, what does all this mean? If God has destined to stand with us, tell me, who could ever stand against us? Nobody. Not a demon from hell can stand. Listen to the devil says to God, You know why is Job worshipping you? Worshipping you. It's because you've placed him on your side. If you could just shift him a bit, God says, there's something you don't know. You don't know, Job. The longer he was on my side, the more of me I rubbed off on him. Because when you are with him, you feel like speaking any in the name of Jesus. So if God is on our side, who can be against us? Put <laughs> I bet a pangwa by him up for no reason. So, Uyusus is dethroning the country so that he's the one so, on the seat. Gumkayawam Lobu, yeah, he's my homeboy. So, Ubanga has a lot of tournament, itangiline, Elamanzi. If we're playing a tournament, there's, there's one tank of water, and there's a lot of people chewing up the water. He would put me in the water. He would say, come, 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 come. He would walk me. He would walk me. He would walk me. He would walk me. He would put me in front of the table. He would say, take a drink. How come those out there? Nobody's going to talk. Hey! So no longer send the ambulance to Paya. When I'm alone, move the city. Land one alone. The land. The bad chong alarm is so hot. And I would look at them. If you dare talk, the zombies. I will call him. The bad salwana. The chiguni. As is so wrong. If God is on our side, go to Paulus. Then tell me who can be against us. On August cars. So get this in your system. Get this in your system. So I'm going to go in the home and don't go dark and die very good with God on our side. In the garden of Getsman. The guys were asked to do it. They were asked a simple question. Are you Jesus? Are you Jesus? He answered. Yes, I am. The Bible. The Bible. I just awake. Yes, I am. Let me end it. Don't be no boy. So Sunday, let me see. Zin, God, I'm dead. When No, he says yes, I am. Yes. What are you going to do to me? May God reveal this Bazalwa. So whatever is chasing you, or whoever is chasing you, they are doing that without God's permission. 
Because to him you are pleasing. You are acceptable. The journey might be rough. But when you are honest, tell the truth, you don't feel the bumps. Because he is your shock absorber. There are vehicles. Of course, my goodness, we not no more now. It's gone in more. Or if you are driving this to Cape Town, you have to rest for a few weeks because your neck is stiff. Your back is killing you. Is the road? Is the nature of the vehicle? Masidi, amen. Yeah, you will hear the old. And it in. Zibe konesi. Then there are other vehicles. It's as if you're coming from pain. What's the difference? On, the, on this side, a bump, a it hits right on your kidneys. On this side, there are actual air shock absorbers here. It's, it's the it's end. So Your kid oh, yes. Jesus is not a tata. When you are in Jesus, you can see that there but no yes. but Jesus is a he takes the shocks of life. What was meant to destroy me, he turns it around. It becomes a praise item. Oh, hallelujah! Hallelujah! <laughs> so, whoever tries to attack you because you are pleasing and acceptable to God, God is not on that. But when you give this, Isaiah 54, give verse 15. Isaiah 54, Uti, verse 15. Whoever attacks you does it without my consent. Whoever fights against you, what will happen to them? They will fall. It's not a suggestion. He is telling you. Whoever fights against you will fall. Just maintain your position. Be on God's side. Let God be on your side. <laughs> there are better be seated. We better than one we wish we get hold of this one, but you know, even hell, whenever they try to plan how to access you, how can we access this one? There's a child who was <laughs> demon possessed and they were casting out the demon. Delivering the child. She screams as this thing is coming out. This thing says, we try to kill you. Where were you killing us? <laughs> in the when I was with my wife from Japan. <laughs> this bus is a dry in land. We are in a cave. We are in our land. It was cutting the cave. So we try to see let us try to cut again. Any other wood and the blind rice. And it was approaching a blind rice. Apa with low lane, apa wood. The truck is in cool, loose water. So we try to let truck. We were overtaking the truck. On a bend. Now as we pass it, there is a bus. So between us and the truck, of course, space. There is no space part way to the truck. I knew there is nothing we're gonna do. Said Jola. We passed. And I was like, how did that happen? About nine months later, 
This child is being delivered here at school. Where is that dry? So it's in those, in those caves. Galamini, that day of the bus. We were, we were destroying you there. There's something they missed. Hey. <laughs> yeah. See, well it we are on this side. Elena Mandla. That is powerful. And I'm saying, no, I believe. I don't know. I believe in that. No, but we are equal. No, but we are equal. And the years my years will answer. No, I don't know how it passed. Years will. But it passed. Because I was so in it, demon, I was calling. Then a demon, a demonic spirit here in school. Leading alamin. So it's on that day. Sasa ni dream. No, we were destroying you. Then they ask, what happened? I like the answer. Who is that big man with, 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 with dressed in white? Yati. Placed his hand. <laughs> Yati, whoa. Mm -hmm. And we passed. Did you say, no. I know that I know. I, my redeemer, is alive. He lives. So, Jesus, do not run away from Jesus. Come to Him. Be on this side. That is the power. <laughs> No, there are some that we're going to shock when we hear them in heaven. Perhaps they will play some videos there. There are things that we're going to shock because we don't know most of these things. Where this man comes and says, Ah! So who do I desire? Whoever attacks you does it without my consent. Whoever fights against you, they will fall. So choose against fear. This is very serious what I just said. Now. Because Usatana is witty. He is not powerful. He is witty. He sows fear. <laughs> there was a season whilst we were in the building project, pro, 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 pro process. <laughs> hey, that's better, man. You. Yeah, hey. That's better. That's better. Mm. Everywhere. Things were coming from every side. Uh, <laughs> never forget this. <laughs> there was a season of about five months I was not sleeping. For five months, could not sleep. That's not evangelistically speaking; is the truth. For five months, I never forget that Easter weekend. In that five months, the, the lies. <laughs> We, we, we said we were going to come here and have Easter here. Do you remember the days of the white chairs? Yes. Mm. So, when you washed those chairs, I would walk away. I would not be around. Because you would say to me, Oh, he can't be a little bit of a little bit of a little bit of a little bit of a little a a Baba impressed the person by a fortana the night before Ukwain Booz Umfund is not yet at and is vang and turned out. I was talking old way. Hey! Diam Kalme! I'm rebuking. Uti Uti Bafaneba excited. He says, no, they can be excited. 
I went to bed. And there was a pain right here. What he come? He said to me, God is a heart attack. <laughs> It was all point for twelve. Uh, after twelve midnight. <laughs> the Bila. The Puma Pes Gubernes. The sweat I got. I, I the fully front bed, door. Open the front door. The old Jigger Gating. Did not have a heart attack in the movie. Yeah. Yeah. And did not have a heart attack. Then come, but thank God, Gulel and Gamma Melon. And did not have a heart attack. I don't have a heart attack. I don't have a heart attack. I don't have a heart attack. He's witty. Unabatinga. He sows. We are each other. Lambeo. So we're driving here that Friday. My kids, all months, are still smaller then. I told my auntie, John, not to hang up. I'm not looking at it. Because he says, this is the greatest embarrassment. We'll go to the four-way stop. And I'm asking the children. Did you go tell us motors? Yeah, because I want to come and face this embarrassment. I want to come and face this embarrassment. I want to come and face this embarrassment. Yo, Dada. See them at school. And I told myself I don't know. Because I don't know what what he's saying is. He sows. But how do you stand against this? And I don't know what is confronting. This morning, when I was thinking about this, the, the impression the Holy Spirit gave me was of someone being washed away by a tide mm, singer. Yeah. You don't know how to say stop. God says this tide is not of the flesh. It's only God who can rescue you from this. Choose not to fear because you're not going to drown. But pastor, what do I do? Stand on the side of God. Someone hears this. Choose against fear. Mamela bo Isaiah forty one. Yo, and shuma ezini, and shuma ezamna. Preaching to myself here. They are not the right ni, and tena namu. Okay, I'm talking to me. Uti nu Isaiah forty one verse ten. Kala ngoti ni fear not. Why? I'm with you. Now. Be not dismayed, for I am your God. What will I do? I will strengthen you. Yes, I will help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. Behold, all those who are incest against you shall be ashamed and disgraced. They shall be as nothing. And those who strive with you shall perish. You shall seek them and you will not find them. Those who contend with you, with those who war against you, shall be as nothing, as a non-existent thing. Did you hear that? Do you think that they are coming to you? What you say? Because you are on my side. When I'm when I'm those I'm telling you, it will be something that is non-existent. Choose not to fear. Stand on God's side. I don't know what you're going through, man. But whatever we're going through, God's word, yes, says, fear not. I'm with you. I will help you. I will strengthen you. I will uphold you with my right hand. It was my right hand. <laughs> but when I'm done with them, they will be like a non-existent <laughs> thing. Do not panic. Let them play. Let them threaten. Let them gossip. 
God says, when I'm done with you, you will look for them and not find them. <laughs> for I, the Lord your God, will hold your right hand, saying to you, fear not. I will help you. Oh, glory to Jesus. Whether it's sickness, God says, fear not. I will help you. Oh, I'm talking to myself here. Whoever tries, they're not going to win. When God is done with them, <laughs> we will look for them and not find them. Since we are pleasing to God, He fights our battles. I'll say it again. Since we are pleasing and acceptable to God, He fights our battles. He doesn't chase battles away. He fights. I said he fights our battle. When I welcome, you must be on this side of God. Here is my confession, my confession. He did it before. He will do it again. I say he did it before to others. He will do it again for me. <laughs> These guys were talking about Thanksgiving. What we are one at you, what you are with us in China. Hey, 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 <laughs> yeah, I am. Why the old Tumga no kwa for my book? Why the old Simila pa? Yes. Sime mezela. Ugunu. I look with you, Eli. Hey, This is a testimony. I got corner on my chand and logo. I got corner, I got corner bandages. What looks alive? Bandages, but similar pa. Simemesela. Don't touch us. Don't no touch. Don't no touch. See it here. See it. Hallelujah. See it. See it. Unastarch. <laughs> Don't touch us. Unastarch. Don't touch us. Yes, well. He fights for us. Yes, well. He fights for us. 
He did it before. <laughs> He'll do it again. For <laughs> I'm talking oh, to someone who wants to surrender. You never do that. In that five months, I didn't have a pen. I was sing alone. Testimony. My testimony. And I would say, here I am. Right in the middle of the bed. But I was proclaiming the victory in the blood of Christ Jesus. He chaos everywhere. Chaos <laughs> but but the he line. did it before. He chased them out when they were put into what to take those who fought him, you, they have not been sent by me. What I'm promising you, they me. will fall. Now, Moses, even with Moses, the Israelites, <laughs> Pharaoh is released. I'm getting enough with this plate. Go to this plant. They they say his wives, they were on the way. What to Faro? Hey, what have we done? Why did we release this people? Oh, his strongest army. What he must see, Joe? Let us pursue them. But they were on the road. When they look behind, there is the army approaching. Bakala Gumosis cried out to Moses, Why did you take us out from the land of Israel? If we are going to be killed, he cried out to God, and God answered. I want you to hear. Chapter fourteen, Exodus verse thirteen. Oti and Moses said to the people. Over three million of them. Over three million of them. Put it. Do not be afraid. Choose against fear. Do not be afraid. Stand still and see the salvation of the Lord. Stand still. Do not be afraid. for the Egyptians who you see today. You shall see again no more forever. I don't know what Egyptians are chasing you, but if you are standing still on God's side and choose not to fear, the promise of God is what you see chasing you, you will see it no more. Because who fights you is fighting against me. Who did the Lord will fight for you? When shut up. Hold your peace. <laughs> I told you this. Age I can repeat any time I want. It's a Bible school. I was at Bible school. <laughs> With my wife from church. It's the whole day. It was holiday time. No, I'm sharing, I'm sharing powerful, powerful things I'm learning from Bible school. Except so, it's it's like night. Night. We're coming from church. Right, moon, a a beautiful thing that is happening here. Now, this is done, done. Here are the lovers. Hey, that kumbu. Then I remembered. That days of looms. In this is how to tell that we're gonna pass. And as no Satan, 
devilish thoughts. Oh, I thought. They have a tendency of not closing the gate. I prayed. But in course, Lord, I'm just asking for these two things. If the gate is not closed, arthritis. Put arthritis on those dogs. Let them bark from a distance in the name of Jesus. Or else that they have remembered to shut the gate. Then as we appear in the, in the corner, the gate is not closed. That plan B. That plan B. Arthritis. Arthritis. In the name of Jesus. <laughs> they growled. They stood up. Zaza. They came. I'm a man. I led her to safety. So fast. When I when I decided to stop. This is how to get hey, to say to her, hey, almost, I know she's not next to me. She's not next to me. And I'm not even hearing the dogs. That's it. I tend. And I she was walking same pace. Did you and then? I was leading you. Why did you not follow? She says to me. You see the speed at which you you took off. I saw that. There was no way I could even try. When I looked at them, there's only one thing that they came to me. Course. I said in the name of Nime the Lord, stand where you are. She says they stood and they turned. Then I said to her, that's what I was telling you, the Bible school, in the Bible school we were he, learning this thing. This is um, it. It's him. me who helped you. Ileno. You are a good listener. It's what I was telling you. <laughs> the name of the Lord is a strong tower. When things are bad, the righteous, they don't run. They walk into the name of the Lord. It is a strong tower. That's the name of the Lord. Not the name of your answer. Not the name of your church. Not the name of your church. Not the name of your The name of your name of the Lord. It is a strong power. Whoever hides in your sin shall be saved. So to stand still and see the salvation of our God. Then God kicked into action. <laughs> when God kicked into action, the eater became the eaten. Now I'm Israel. Now I'm Luan. Now here the there is the sea. Here comes God and he puts what on a key. Now, so now, okay, he kicked into me. action. Right there. Listen to verse 19. Uti and the angel of God who went before the camp of Israel. It was ahead of Uti moved yeah. and went behind them. The pillar that went before them, the pillar of cloud, it moved and stood behind them. So it came between the camp of Israel and the Egyptians. 
listen to this the cloud gave darkness to the enemy and light to the Israelites. Did you get that? So that whoever wanted to come this way could not know which way to go. It happened all night long. No, 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 no. Went throughout the night. God fixing the situation. Yeah, man. So, tears might last, might last in the evening. But joy comes in the morning. It might be your evening where. Just hold on there. The morning is coming. Yes, in us. Then Moses stretched out his hand over the sea. And the Lord caused the sea to go back by a strong east wind all night and made the sea into dry land. And the waters were divided. So the children of Israel went into the midst of the sea on dry ground. I had again not in the mud. Not when you take a corner. Not when there's God. No, you don't narrowly escape. He prepares a table for me. <laughs> Think about this. Those that persecute you. Those that are after you. And I would take up better sin. Instead of knocking the God will prepare a table. Everything in me says, Babula and God, who did them, Lord? Ah, ah, ah. Oh, and I will fuck up. The most painful is what I put them, I'm putting them in. You only taffy. Now I'm allowed. Here are the clouds. Here is everything. All of it is here. And the chair is pulled. And I was placed on the chair. He sit over there. There are the enemies. As Guazu Sondela. They can't come close. <laughs> Which is now it came to pass. Okay. So Banga and Elwan, the mother of Israel. Avalande, La Machipu. The Israelites followed them through the sea. But now it came to pass in the morning watch, that the Lord looked down upon the army of the Egyptians through the cloud the pillar of fire and cloud. And what did he do? He troubled. Everybody say he troubled. Say it again. He troubled. He's going to trouble them. He's going to trouble it. He's going to trouble your trouble. <laughs> He's going to trouble your trouble. You see next year. Get ready. I'm telling you. Yeah. Next year. Get ready. <laughs> what should you go 2017? God said that in 2017. What did 2020? Said 2020. Get ready. So he troubled them. What did he do? He took off their chariot wheels. So that they drove them with difficulty. And the Egyptians said, let us flee from the face of Israel for the Lord fights for them. Too late. 
Then the Lord said to Moses, after they've crossed, stretch out your hand over the sea, that the waters may come back upon the Egyptians, on their chariots and on their horsemen. And Moses stretched out his hand over the sea, and when the morning appeared, the sea returned to its full depth, while the Egyptians were, in, were right in there, trying to flee. So the Lord overthrew the Egyptians in the midst of the sea. You're fighting us. So I want to encourage you. Just be on the Lord's side. Choose not to fear. Whatever troubles you. Do not say where is God. He's creating a stage for the greatest display <laughs> of his splendor. When the enemy thought I got my knee on your throat, God is preparing a stage for maximum celebration. I want to pray for you. Don't quit. Every head bowed and every eye closed. Please. I want you to listen to this charge. Paul says, so then my friends, because of God's great mercy to us, I appeal to you, offer yourselves as a living sacrifice to God, dedicated to his service and pleasing to him. Once your head is bowed and your eyes closed, maybe you have moved out of your position. That's why you can't overcome because you're fighting by yourself. I appeal to you like Paul appealed to these brethren. He says, I appeal to you. Offer yourselves to God. Dedicated to him as a living sacrifice. My friend, he wants to control every fiber of your being. Don't give him portions. Could you be sitting here today? You accepted Jesus. But the life doesn't say so. I appeal to you. Offer your body to him as a living sacrifice that will be pleasing to God. I want to pray with you. Your heart tells you this is what you need to do. Why don't you stand up where you are seated come here to this altar and say, Mfundis, I'm dedicating my life. Yes, I'm saved. But oh man, come, I want to pray with you. The second person I want to pray with, you've never given Jesus the right to rule your life. He's not your savior. Today you say, man, it's my day. Why don't you stand up where you are sitting? Come and join these in the front. I want to pray with you. I want to pray with you. I want to pray with you. 
Paul says, I appeal to you. As I am appealing to you here. With our heads bowed and our eyes closed. Men, 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 choose not to fear. If you are on God's side, he fights your battles. When you walk to this altar, you are saying to God, I am choosing your side. Come. I want to pray with you. The addictions on your life, you will never conquer them until you choose his side. I want to pray with you. You've been messed up by gossip. People have lied and you listen. You can't even receive the thing, anything from God. Come and dedicate your life. And say, Lord, I'm sorry. I am sorry. I'm sorry. Come, I want to pray with you. If you haven't walked from that eye, I'm asking you, I'm appealing to you. I don't care who you are. His arms are stretched out. He's waiting on you. Come. I'm alive to tell a story How I overcome His goodness and mercy And the power of the blood I'm so glad, I'm so glad that my freedom wasn't based on what I've done. It's goodness and mercy and the power of the blood. I'm alive, I'm alive to tell a story how I overcome. How I And the power, and the power of the blood. I'm so glad, I'm so glad that my freedom was in place on what I've done. It's goodness and mercy and the power of the blood. I'm alive to tell the story. I'm alive. 
cross and pace on what I'm telling All his goodness His and mercy And the power of the blood I don't care what the devil says it is the goodness of God that says no to evil. I want everyone standing here in the front please, to pray this prayer after me. Gogundiva, Gogundiva, Undipendu, Undipendu, Nabu Bombam, Nabu Bombam, the Bunigel Sandensa, the Bunigel Sandensa, the Ned Tikoa, the Ned Tikoa, Undkulul, Undkulul, Undikole, Undikole, Undisindis, Undisindis, Dia Voma, Dia Vom, and the Nawaman, and the Nawaman, God with Tembalam, God with Tembalam. Listen, Listen, Satan. Satan. Get Gamalin Kosuye. Get Gamalin Kosuye. Woyisiwe. Woyisiwe. Mbilwenya. Mbilwenya. Susela ngalom zuzu. Susela ngalom zuzu. Dingo wake. Dingo wake. Ungo wam. Ungo wam. Yabule la ba. Yabule la ba. Now, Lord, I'm praying. Yo, God. But in our brokenness, Father, in our vulnerability, David See the verse Today, here are our bodies dedicated to you as a living sacrifice, pleasing and acceptable to our God. We are agreeing with the heavens this morning, this day, that when you come, you will not find a weak church. You will find a victorious church. victory. Somebody is a Yesu kongendao. Izi fo siapila. Zono ziakolelwa. Ziakolelwa zonke. Namtlanje, we are presenting our bodies to you, Father. It's goodness and mercy. That has made us to overcome. So I'm praying for every life, every heart 
on this altar. Mercy. 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 The burdens are removed. The yokes are destroyed. We will find rest for our soul. It's goodness and mercy. Oh gosh. Come on, just pray in your own way. Pray. Pray in your own way. Pray in your own way. Let's pray. Pray.